in. You can have the door open, but you got to walk through it. And you got to help yourself. Amen. Give her a hand. Give her a hand. This is just. So I had to go to the Y and say, can you take us in? And so the Y actually did. And so, Robin, I'm going to just ask you to say whatever you want to say. <laughs> you were in class, but you saw all the people. And, and to be honest, the Y and tell Sheriff, you make space for us. So whatever you want to say. So I was not in the class. <coughs> And I regret or hate that I was not available to be in the class, but I told Quasi I was going to be here today yes. to support him and his mission. Because mm -hmm. this is a mission, his purpose and his calling. Yes. 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 Stand up. in the class because I had work on my business. So today, I decided I wanted to be able to, to make it here to see what all the others said. But I can say that they have been you know, sending us in the group from the Y, our work, one, of our, one of the workout classes, uh, Mary has been good about sending us uh, videos and so forth. From it. And what I see from it is not only encouragement for, you know, one, I'm thankful that people showed up. And two, because that means that they're willing to learn or gain some sort of insight they can better their, themselves and their own health. Two, I also saw a lot of um, something that would promote, not teamwork is the way, but camaraderie, like we're in this together. How can we encourage each other in different ways? 
to, you know, so I would see some of that play through some of the videos that they would share. And okay. Thanks so much. Yeah, okay, we're, we're winding down, but there are a couple of things I want to say as we kind of wind down. Uh, you, you know, I, I just got a feeling just being in this group and and being here that, um, and it just hit me. I I think at one of my birthday parties, I want to I want to invite everybody in the group to come to a birthday party. Yeah. Now, it's going to be a birthday party that breaks the bank. I have to tell my wife. I can going to have to save it now. Where everybody brings something. Yeah, but, well, well, I, I, want you to, I want it to be my, my treat. We're going to go into 401k, and we're just going to. We just, we just, we just, and, and I'm asking me, maybe we might be able to do it here. I may, I may just lay it out. It's a birthday party. I got all your names. You're going to get invited. But here's the rub. I'm 71. I want to have a birthday party for all of us when I'm 100. Yeah. That means <laughs> I'm 29 years. I got to be here 29 years. Right. Right. You do too. Yeah. <laughs> so, 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 so in 20, uh, 53, uh, that, that, that if we are intentional about taking care of our health, wouldn't it be a great thing for us to, to, to come and to, to be here? And I, I want to end by how many of you heard the music I had coming on when we first? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Y'all know that song? Yeah. 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 Delia, do you know that song? I do. Oh, okay. <laughs> Y'all people know that song? She heard all the oldies. <laughs> <laughs> you, you know, and um, I, I, I want to end. I, I, I chose that song intentionally, and some of you know it's We Are the World. And why that song is so important for all of us right now, you know, Quincy Jones just died. He, yes, he just died. He was 91 years old. And, and they, they interviewed him and they said, before he died, of course, and they, they said, well, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Can't, can't do it when he's dead. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> but, but they interviewed Quincy and they said, well, how, how did you do all the stuff that you did? And, you know, from Frank Sinatra to Michael Jackson, all these years, and you're still doing all this stuff. And what he said is, I just saw opportunities and I just went for it. Just the opportunities presented themselves, and I took advantage of the opportunities. I don't have a plan. And then I just thought, well, how appropriate that is for us, because I don't care how old you are, there still can be opportunities that come to us, even at this age, even at this time, that all we have to do is to follow it. How do I know this? This is an opportunity for me. I wasn't, I wasn't planning on doing this. I would, but, but the thing that it just presented itself, and I said, oh, okay, I'll step in. And so I just say, as we think about what we're going to do further, just look for the opportunities that are already uh, in your path and coming your way. And I want you to think about three questions that we kind of already have talked about. One is you want to understand what's your why. That is really critical. The other thing you want to find out is who, who where's your community? Do you have a community? Who, who, you, you, you should be able to, 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 to point to that. And, and then, of course, you want to make sure, are you focusing in on the things that you can control? Otherwise, we're, we're going to have trouble. And then finally, I'm going to tell my team, <coughs> Tracy, American Heart Association, Monique, we, we have some work to do. So what we're going to do 
is that we're going to gather now and think about what's the next step because I want to make sure that you all follow, continue your journey, but you don't need to do it alone. So we're gonna figure out how we can all come together and to support you in that journey. And so what I'm asking you, and I think we have all of your names and numbers, we're gonna contact you when we have another step where we want to go to let you know what we're going to do. And so, so it won't be uh, alone. So let me just give uh, a minute or two. Does anyone have a question or comment you want to make before we leave? And it's okay if you don't. Okay. Oh, so, I'd like to say something. Um, I forgot to count it out. During the uh, pilot program, um, dedicated seniors, um, it excuse me, it helped me to know what billing a relation, a community, a connection, because even though I do a lot for Columbus, I'm kind of shy, <laughs> it's hard to believe, but it helped me, <laughs> it really is, but it helped me to um, bring out words and listen intensely to what others have had to bring to the table. And that helped me with my journey, with my walk, as, long, as well as God, because it was really hard. I was weighing like 99 pounds. I am now, thanks by the goodness of God, 105. Isn't God good, class? Yes, he is. You were ever shy. This class ever did something to help you. Yes. You talked about community. Yes. I've been in Columbus for years. Since I've been six years with no family. Yes. I go to Blendenwood, yes. I go to Griswold, I go to Westerville, and I come here. Yes. Mm. And in doing that for yeah. my community. Yes. yes. Yes, yes, it's so, that's so important. And there's a African saying that if you want to go fast, go alone. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But if you want to go far, go together. Yes! Woo! yes. And, and family, this health journey is it, 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 it's not something that happens overnight. It, it, it's going to be a journey. And so I just want to end with just, uh, okay, Steve. Um, <clears throat> can you mention something about the virtual night? Okay, sure, <laughs> absolutely. Yeah. So, so one of the things that I'm very much involved in is that the Metro Parks has winter hikes. And my wife and I uh, go on those hikes and you, they, they're up around all of these metro parks all around the city and uh, and we just love and have so much fun you know going out there's a whole community and they have hot chocolate and you go out and you walk to the to the degree that you want to walk you don't have to go far but I like the community and I also like the idea that yes even in winter we can get outside now, now the key thing is you got to bundle up you, 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 you got to dress but I love it below zero. I, I can go out and I can walk. Yes, <laughs> but I and, and 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 my brother here. Yeah, we I made a video. But my brother here is, is taking a picture at the left. His name is Reggie Cook. And 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 one time I put a picture of me in the winter heights and I was out there and 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 all warm and he called and said, will you take that picture off of Facebook? <laughs> you embarrassing the whole family. You know that we don't go out there in the winter like that. Take that picture, you embarrassing me? But, 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 but absolutely, you know, with the, there can be and we'll have more information for those of you who would like to go on a winter hike. But I want to bring this to a close and I, I want to bring it to a close. Did I see your hand? Oh, okay. <laughs> now she she she's with the American Heart. I, I will stop in a minute. But 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 I just want to end, you know, with this. And we we heard the song, but did we hear the words? You know, when we said we are the world. And I'm just saying, we are the world. We are the children. We are the ones who make a brighter day. So let's start giving. There's a choice. There's an intentional choice we're making. We're saving our own lives yeah. by our intentional choice 
We are saving our own lives. It's true. We'll make a better day, just you and me. I go. Amen. I go.